use SMAW and PAW for that material. Richard Barnes helps companies design, build, and operate pressure vessel systems, including nuclear power plants. And he helps ensure their safety by helping develop codes and standards. Barnes's commitment to safety comes as a business owner and as a longtime volunteer with ASME and Canadian standard setting organizations. Barnes grew up in Australia on the outskirts of Brisbane. He went to the University of Queensland, earning both a bachelor's and master's degree in engineering. With his bride Anne, Barnes left in 1966 for a vacation to North America. Good jobs were available in Canada for young engineers. Barnes settled in Toronto, starting what would be a 27-year engineering career in nuclear power, first at Atomic Energy Canada and then at Ontario Hydro. Today, Barnes owns ANRIC Enterprises, which provides consulting, training, design review, and compliance services. He built it from a two-person firm beginning in 1993. Barnes has been a longtime ASME volunteer, including for 13 years as chair of the Committee on Construction of Nuclear Facility Components. Colleagues say his strong leadership is illustrated by the resolution of a disagreement between ASME and the Nuclear Regulatory Commission, the NRC. In 1994, ASME proposed code changes, following research showing pipe may fail in an earthquake in a different manner than previously understood. The NRC questioned some of the code changes. Barnes developed an approach to better present the technical foundation for the changes. The NRC withdrew its objections, bringing a 10-year effort to a successful conclusion. Another example of leadership is a program Barnes initiated to resolve disagreements over how to evaluate fatigue damage in pressure vessels. Barnes has been influential in the development of Canadian pressure vessel code, and he has always had a global mindset. He supported holding ASME meetings across South America, Europe, and Asia. He assists overseas companies in qualifying for ASME conformity assessment certificates. And in Japan, he led code development for a team of fusion power researchers. For his leadership in the research, development, promotion, acceptance, and application of ASME codes and standards, and for management in the design, construction, and operational support of nuclear power plants, ASME awards Richard Barnes the Melvin R. Green Codes and Standards Medal.